Hello everybody, welcome back. It is Sunday, we just got home from church and I need to get some hamburger buns going before I do anything because we're having burgers tonight for dinner. So I will share this recipe. I've shared it many, many, many times, but um, very simple, very delicious, like perfect. You can't get any better than this. So we're gonna go ahead and get this going so we can have hamburger buns in time for dinner. Our first step is a one cup of warm water. Let's see. With sugar, no, dissolve yeast in warm water. Okay, where's my yeast? And two tablespoons of yeast. Oh my and we're gonna let this proof for a few minutes. This could proof some more, but I'm gonna just go ahead and <clears throat> add my stuff because I've got lots of things to get done. So one egg, a quarter cup of sugar, and a quarter cup of shortening, but I use coconut oil. Whisk this around. salt too. I'm supposed to put half a tablespoon of salt in there. And three and a third cup of flour. In need for seven minutes. Now we let this rise for about 30 minutes or until doubled. Now that we are done on break, I need to get school stuff prepared for the upcoming week. And the kids, Ashlyn just said, I am not ready for a full day of school tomorrow because it was a nice break. degrees today. It is absolutely beautiful. So now we are going to cook these at 350 for 10 to 12 minutes. So I just got those put in the oven. Haven't really filmed much of anything because we haven't done much of anything since we've been home from church. Um, besides make these, I got the school stuff together. We've been outside and my father-in-law stopped by. So not much to film. Today's video might be really, really, really short. So um, I need to go ahead and look and see if there's anything that I need to prep for tomorrow or anything I need to pull out for tomorrow. I don't even know we're having like any of the meals. So I don't know if I need to pull out meat for tomorrow's dinner ahead of time. Um, tonight we're gonna do burgers and fries. I thought about doing potato salad and baked beans with the burgers, but 
I have lots of little kids that won't eat any of that. So I could, but I could just make fries and be done. So I think I'm just gonna make fries and be done. Um, and then I need to go see if there's anything I need to prep for tomorrow, pull out for tomorrow kind of thing. And I don't know, I might sit down and read and just kind of relax for a little bit. Because I think I've gotten everything else done that I needed to do over the weekend. Because the school stuff's done. I brought up all the food that we're going to need for the week yesterday. I feel like there was something else, though, that I cannot remember. Hopefully I do remember if there was anything else. Maybe I'm just thinking of something and it's not even true. I don't know. But I feel like I'm missing something that I was supposed to be doing. But we'll see. So overnight oats, strawberry bread, chicken nuggets, and salmon, apples and peanut butter, and hamburger helper. So there's nothing I really need to do um, besides overnight oats. But I don't even know if I'm going to do those or not. Honestly, I don't know. We'll see. I might just skip that and do something else. I'm not really feeling that. I'm not really feeling eating that. But we'll know later if I want to do it or not. All right, here's our hamburger buns for dinner. They came out a lot bigger than I normally make them, so uh, I'm a little nervous about that. I guess normally I cut them smaller, but oh well, they're still beautiful, and they're still going to taste really good. So we've been outside playing with the kids because it is just so beautiful outside that we don't even want to do anything else. And it's been wonderful. Well, outside, they've got um, some toys, and we're just playing with them. But I'm coming in to season the meat for dinner. Just our, we're gonna have burgers. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of seasoning and Worcestershire sauce on it and let it sit. I'm gonna make Gary, I'm gonna let Gary make the patties um, just because, I don't know, he always does a good job with the size. So I'm gonna let him do that part, but I am gonna season them. So let's figure out what we're gonna put on this. Let's do steak seasoning and Worcestershire. I think that's it. The simpler the better with a burger. You just don't need much when it comes to a burger. So we'll just put some of the steak seasoning, uh, Montreal steak seasoning, but it's from Aldi and it's like, I think it used to be 79 cents. It's probably like 99 cents now with inflation or whatever. And we're just gonna put this on it as well. I'm gonna massage it around and let him make patties, like I said, but that's it. Very, very simple. Sometimes he likes to add like different things and an egg and like all this stuff. And I personally think that they're just better plain, but that's just me. So now I'm just going to put this back in the fridge until he's ready to make patties and grill. Bless you. All right, dinner's done. Fries and burgers. Simple dinner Sunday. All right, we're finishing our day off outside. So thank you guys for watching and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.